Hi everybody. In this video I, I wanted to share something I've run into several times that it might help some of my viewers if you're doing antenna work. Uh, one of the things I try to do whenever I'm doing an antenna is use the existing wire that's already in the house. That way I don't have to drill any new holes. And uh, one of the things I encounter is a lot of times there'll be a little device in the coaxial line that will block TV signals if the person had a satellite system and it's called a diplexer. Now when I first started out doing antennas I didn't know that the difference between a diplexer and a splitter. I didn't realize that one half of this uh, diplexer here, the half that it's usually the side that has the DC pass through will literally block TV signals. In fact I did a video oh I think it was probably about a year ago where I talked about one of the problems I had run into. Uh, a woman hired me to hook up an antenna for three different TVs and basically what happened was, well I should have done it like this, it would have been a simple no-brainer TV antenna, splitter, three televisions, problem solved. But because I tried to use the existing wire and I didn't want to drill any new holes, I, uh, I tried to do it like this. I used what they called the diplexer that had the DC pass-through, designed to block TV signals, not knowing it. So when I was done, the first TV had great reception, second TV was missing channels, third TV had no channels. And thanks to one of my viewers who goes by Steve's project, Steve, if you're watching, thank you. He pointed out that I'd used the wrong kind of a signal splitter. So I thought it was worth going over again in this video because it's probably a fairly common thing. Now, if you look at these splitters here, where I drew a red line uh, across what they call the DC pass-through portion. And basically, the red line indicates where the signal will be blocked. So in other words, no t TV signal can pass from here to here, if that was my input. It, it would work fine going from here to here, but not on this side. This one blocked, uh, what do I have? Oh, it looks like two, two of the outputs here were blocked. And uh, on the other hand, these ones over here, these, these are fine. These are all more conventional signal splitters. And they didn't attenuate my signal at all. In fact, one of these had a DC pass-through but it still didn't block the TV signals. So uh, I just thought I'd go over that again for the people that uh, might be new to this trade and um, who knows, maybe it'll help somebody. Anyway, that's basically all I've got to say. I want to wish everybody a uh, happy holidays and uh, Merry Christmas. Thanks for watching as always and uh, hope to catch you in the next video.